I gotta glue up this frame, but I have a bit of a problem. It is a bit bigger than my longest clamps can reach. So just build a longer clamp, right? But I've never made my own bar clamps because making an adjustable locking mechanism like this out of wood would be really hard and most screws have much less lead per turn than the screws on here and then I'd still need a pad on the end and these things really don't cost that much so it's not worth the trouble. I could also hook two clamps together but that just gets too fiddly so maybe if I could just extend the clamp because I only need the screw thingy on one side. And so I came up with this clamp extender and the regular clamp just fits into here Close that in to lock it and then I can just use that as though it was a really long clamp. And I've used this already gluing together this frame here, but for this frame I want to be able to glue multiple joints at the same time because there's a little bit of twist in the joints. And so I gotta build some more. I need a slot to accept the bar of the clamp and I'll just cut that all the way through so I can cut out this part with a bandsaw. Clamp fits in here, now I just need a backstop, which will be this piece glued in the slot. This hole creates a weak spot, so I'm going to reinforce it like this. Now I need to cut some slots in here to attach this part here, and I'll just put this whole thing, clamps and all, in my box joint jig. I cut the slots in here quite narrow because this is actually the weak part. This part is a fair bit wider this way and it's also a denser wood. Now I just need to cut much wider slots in this for it to fit into here. Now as this clamp is tightened, it has a tendency to come up like this, which is why I have these tabs on here to hold it in place. Lock it in and let it out. Now this works fine as long as I'm clamping a box that's opened like this, but if I want to clamp like this, I have a problem, but I have a solution for that. I've taken the rivet out of the end of this clamp, so I can put the end on backwards and now I'll put this in here like so and now I can clamp like this. For the first two joints of this frame I can just glue them together one at a time, though I have the other joints dry fit to make it easier to clamp. And when gluing multiple joints at the same time, there's really no time to fiddle with trying to hook clamps end to end. So these things really save a lot of time and make it easier. 